Hi everyone, in this video we are going to cover the ultimate stability exercise for gymnast. We are going to be covering the airplane exercise. I am Dwayne Scotty. I'm a physical therapist with Spark Physical Therapy. And today I really wanted to talk about one of my favorite exercises that I commonly will look in terms of assessing a gymnast and their stability, as well as offering them an exercise to help improve their stability and strength. So if you are a gymnast and you have chronically weak ankles, or you're a chronic ankle sprainer, so you've sprained your ankle multiple times, you roll that ankle, and you're looking for more stability, or you have a history of hip pain. So maybe your hip started hurting, and you're one of those gymnasts who are kind of super bendy, right? You have a lot of flexibility, and your hip hurts you sometimes when you are performing your splits, or you are doing any of your tumbling passes, and or landing on the leg. So one of the exercises that I like to look at to see what a gymnast baseline measurement when we're looking at screening a gymnast, either kind of preseason and looking at injury prevention to get them going on a program is to see if they can perform the airplane exercise. So I did post this exercise um, yesterday, a video of it, so you can take a look at that. I'll also include a link um, within this post here to, so you can be able to see the exercise, but I really feel strongly about the benefits of this exercise in terms of assessing, seeing what someone's hip control is. So specifically the hip muscles and your external rotator muscles, so kind of the deep stabilizers in the hip joint, which controls where your kneecap is placed, as well as your ankle stability. So looking at the muscles that help stabilize your ankle while you're doing your different movements, if you think about the activities that you're doing on the beam, when you're on one leg and you're balancing and you're doing different arabesque movements and you're turning on the beam, and then obviously when you're landing from a series on the beam, then that requires a significant amount of ankle stability. So the airplane exercise is good to look at hip stability as well as ankle stability, and it can be utilized as an exercise to strengthen those muscles. So to help improve the stability of those muscles, to help strengthen those muscles, as well as prehab. So kind of, I have implemented this exercise as part of an active warm-up or kind of your normal practice warm-up. So implementing this exercise, if you're a gymnastics coach out there and you're looking for what is an exercise that I can add into my warm-up that will give me the most bang for my buck and help keep my gymnast healthy throughout the season, throughout the year, help reduce ankle sprains, help reduce knee pain, help reduce hip pain. If I had to choose one exercise, it would be this airplane exercise, all right, because it does hit all of those areas. You're getting more bang for your buck, you're getting ankle stability, hip stability, helps decrease knee pain, the joint in the middle. So that would be the exercise I would add in if you're looking at how do I prevent injuries as part of a prehab program, as well as if you're looking to improve your performance and improve your stability so you're more stable on the beam, this would be a good exercise to add in. And then I commonly will have or add this exercise into my treatment of gymnasts after they do have an injury. So after they've sprained their ankle and we're working those muscles back to helping stabilize and prevent future ankle sprains, as well as those that have those super bendy hips and they have too much mobility, so it's a stability issue and they're looking for more stability. This is a great exercise that I'll have my clients um, utilize to help improve that stability of the joint to help decrease their pain. Does that make sense? Does that make sense that you would want an exercise that not only targets one muscle group, but targets multiple areas? So multiple muscles as well as addressing multiple joints. If that makes sense to you, type in make sense into the comment section. So that is my take on why I think the airplane exercise is the ultimate stability exercise for gymnasts to be adding into their program. I hope this post and some of this information helps you. If it does help you, I would appreciate if you hit the like or the love button. That will help this video reach more people like yourself who are looking at ways to help gymnasts kind of prevent pain stay healthy throughout the season, and or recover from a specific injury. So again, I've been uh, Dr. Dwayne Scotty, physical therapist with Spark Physical Therapy, where we help active adults and athletes get back to the sports and the workouts they love without pain, rest, 
or multiple trips to the doctors throughout the week. If you are interested in some of the services that I can provide, if you are in the Wallingford area in Connecticut, then I would be happy to talk with you about that. If you want more information on some of the work that I've done with gymnasts, please visit my website, sparkyourtraining.com. I hope you all have a great day. Thank you for watching.